morning everybody on this Sunday, December 16th. And over my shoulder is the last minute of my blueberry muffins that I made this morning. So I think I told you guys last night that I was gonna make blueberry muffins this morning. Um, I had some blueberries left from last week that I wanted to get used up. So I'm still in my nightgown because, believe it or not, I woke up before John did. Like, how is that even a thing? Because that never happens. But I woke up before John, so I left him in the bedroom. I made the muffins, he just came out of bed um, just now. So I was like, well, perfect timing. The muffins are about to pop out of the oven. Um, trying to put the oven mitt on one handed. There they are. Um, but I have already made muffins. Let's go ahead and get them out. Make sure they're done. They look cute. Um, they might need another minute. Here they are. I think they might need another minute. I'm gonna put them back in and let them cook for another minute. Um, it looks like half of them are done, half of them aren't. Anyway, so it's Sunday and it is, what time is it? Nine o'clock, I got up at eight. Um, so the muffins are almost done. I'm gonna go get in the shower now that John's awake and then I'm gonna go upstairs and get my, uh, my foundation review started. Um, we gotta get the dishes done. There's so many dishes here. So many dishes, cause I made those sticky buns last night. Um, and yeah, Neil's still asleep. He actually came home from work, went over to his friend's house. I honestly don't know what time he got home. If I had to guess, it was probably like two or three in the morning. He told me he was gonna be home at like 1130. I'm pretty sure that didn't happen because I'm gonna show you through all the boxes. I think we're gonna clean up all the boxes today. Can you guys see that is his parking space all the white little stones he's actually parked at the back of the driveway it looks like he literally pulled in the driveway and like ran in the house um but anyway that's where we are this morning um that's, i told you the tree's all decorated so that's done over there and they're playing a video game well nick's playing a video game um anyhow i think i'm gonna make um Actually, I'm going to leave that on. I'm going to make ice cream later on today and throw that in the freezer for um, Christmas. So that's done. I'm thinking about making actually two batches of it and throwing it in the freezer. Because um, you can't make like a double batch. You actually have to make two separate batches. So I think I might make two batches and throw that in the freezer. And what else? I still have to make those cookies, but I don't think I'm gonna have time to make cookies today. I just don't think I'm gonna have time. Uh, we are going over to my mother-in-law's house um, for lunch. And then I think we're gonna go to Verizon and talk to them about phones. And then we're gonna go to my dad's house for dinner. So I don't know how much more I'm gonna film throughout the day. You guys know Sundays are not my, usually my highly filmed days because we spend so much time with family. Um, but I'll try to film here and there where we can. Um, I don't know what else to say. I don't know what else to say. Hey, why didn't the beads get put back on the tree? Because it got tangled in a knot and I didn't get Alright, I'll untangle them. Anyway, I just wanted to say good morning and we're gonna have some muffins for breakfast and we will see you guys later on today. Bye. Alright y'all, we are at Verizon and we're getting new phones. So I figured I'd come on and say hello one last time on my old phone. Um, this is an iPhone 6 Plus that I have and I am buying an iPhone XS Max. We'll be paying on it for the next two years, but John's phone's free. That's why we're switching carriers from Sprint to Verizon because if we would have stayed with Sprint, um, we wouldn't have got on any free phones. So John's phone's free. Neil is buying a new phone. Um, but that's where we're at. So, um, I am sad. I know that may sound very silly that I'm sad, but I've really liked this phone. It's done a really good job for me for the last four plus years. And now it's time to get a new one and I'm sad and I'm sad I'm spending so much money, but I probably won't, um, buy another new phone for like five more years so anyway um the next time you see me i'm gonna be on my new phone so 
we'll see how the quality is different in the video um, because the other cam the, the cameras should have come a long way in the last four years but yeah anyway I will see you guys in a little while all right y'all this is my new phone <laughs> you'll have to tell me how the quality is um, I don't have my pop socket on the back yet so it's really hard for me to hold uh, <laughs> yeah i'm so used to having that it's so weird when you don't have it you never really really blah, blah, blah. you never really realize what you're missing if you don't have it but once you have it it is like a lifesaver like seriously this is my old phone um you've never seen it because i'm always filming on my phone so this is my old six six plus um my pop socket which i will miss but i have a new one uh i actually bought one it was on sale at target um a couple months ago and i knew that we were looking to replace our phones so i actually bought it it was on sale what is it 750 it's a vegan leather um pop socket so this will be on my new phone so yeah i just have to get it out and I need to make sure that everything is good on the phone and the case. We bought um, life proof cases because I actually prefer the OtterBox, but the, um, the life proof case is actually waterproof, which the OtterBox is not. It does also have the plastic cover on the screen. Uh, so it does have its own screen protector. I have always had this glass. I actually do have a glass screen protector on this phone. This is of everything on my phone. This is the thing that I've replaced the most. I've had this phone for what, like four and a half years, something like that. And the glass screen protector I have replaced, I think four times. That is the thing that I've replaced the most. This is my second case in four years. And then the screen protector. I've only ever had the one pop socket. So sorry, my nose is itchy like right there at the end of my nose. Anybody else get that? I think it's the foundation. I'm ready to get this foundation off. I've had it on for almost nine hours, eight and a half, almost nine hours. Anyway, um, so I do protect my phone really like a lot. Um, actually the guy who sold us the phone, he automatically put on the insurance policy um, on, on the phones. And I'm like, no, I don't need that. He's like, of course you do. I'm like, no, I don't need that. He's like, well, then you'll be really upset when you come in here in six months and you dropped your phone and your phone broke because you're going to pay off the old phone and buy a new phone. I'm like, no, I don't need that. Um, I mean, when we took our phones in to get the batteries replaced, the guy who looked at it to make sure that there was no uh, like water, existing water damage or anything like that, they actually like pull it open and look at it. He was like, did you just get this? Like, did you just buy this? Like, recently i said no he, i was like why and he said because it is amazingly clean inside i said yeah i take care of my phones and i do like i said i do um i've broken the screen the glass screen cover a couple of times um but i do try to take care of my phone i actually have if you look closely there's actually a piece of tape over the apple symbol because there's no cover over the apple symbol on this case so i want to I wanted to not have my Apple symbol scratch. Is that is that weird? Is that weird? Like seriously, I am weird, hundred percent. I am weird. I know it. Is. I know I am. But anyway, my biggest problem with this phone so far is that it doesn't have the button, and I miss the button a lot. I keep trying to do the hit the button, and there's no button on my new phone. So there's that. Anyway. It is pay-per-view wrestling night. The boys are downstairs watching a wrestling match. It started, what time is it? It's 7.15. It started about 15 minutes ago. Um, and they're, they're watching that. Neil actually invited a friend over, believe it or not. He's never invited a friend over, like, since elementary school. I think it was the last time he invited a friend over. Um, but his, his one friend just got home from college, so he invited his friend over. So they are downstairs, and they are watching the wrestling match so I'm gonna edit yesterday's vlog like I said it's 7 15 I'm gonna edit yesterday's vlog and then go into editing Tuesday's taste test video I'm gonna take my old computer my work computer that's not working I don't know I think I told you guys I got a new work computer this on Monday um, but I didn't have the old one with me so I need to take the old one back in tomorrow when I go into the office I'm gonna take my work phone downstairs and my badge downstairs so that's on the to-do list um, take off this makeup is on the to-do list 
and download all my apps and log back into all my all my apps that's on the to-do to list as well so you'll have to let me know what you guys think of the video quality if the video quality is better um i have not downloaded any of my well, obviously this is the first video that i'm taking on my new phone but um I'm going to download it and see what the video quality is like. But I'm going to edit yesterday's vlog. I'm going to go into editing Tuesday's taste test video while the boys are watching wrestling. So I will see you all in a little while. Bye. Well, it is time for bed. And I did not get as much done as I wanted to. I actually already have my mouth guard in. I already have my face done and my skincare and my teeth brushed and all that good stuff. And it is 11 o'clock. And it is time for bed. Neil's friends are still here, but we're all going. Well, Nick and John and I. There's John right there. Do you like his phone case? Show him your phone case. Oh, hold on. John got an orange phone and a pink, purple ish phone case. So, my phone case is blue or green, blue, like a blue green, like an aqua color with like or an orange stripe. Anyhow, you don't care what our phone cases look like. Um, we're going to bed. Um, I think I might just go into the office for like a half a, half a day tomorrow. I think that's what I might do. I don't know. We'll see when I get there and what I get my hands into and all that good stuff. Um, but that's, I think that's the plan for right now. I'm not planning on packing a lunch. I'm planning on just... Um, coming home and making lunch so that's the plan as of right now but for right now it's time for bed i did get yesterday's vlog edited that's uploading now hopefully it, the upload works fine and it's ready to go and it's already uploaded by the time i wake up tomorrow um but the taste test tuesday i did not get uploaded um my epic beauty fail for tuesday is uploaded so I, tomorrow night, I have to edit Tuesday's taste test video. Um, I need to film Wednesday's what I ate in a day, which might either be tomorrow or Tuesday. I'm not sure which day I'm going to film that, but I have blueberry muffin to eat and I actually have a frozen dinner, a vegan frozen dinner that I'm probably going to eat, um, for lunch. And then I don't know what we'll do for dinner. I don't know. Anyway. Uh, today I am thankful for my new phone. I'm thankful for John's new phone and I'm thankful for Neil's new phone. Neil actually bought a new phone. He actually bought the same phone as John has. It's the iPhone XR. Um, I think it hurt him a little bit to do so, but he bought it and he bought his case. So it's for independent. Well, we told him when we bought his last phone that that was going to be the last phone we would buy for him because the next time he would be due for a phone, he'd, he'd be an adult. So he had different options. He could get an iPhone or he could have gotten like a Samsung or something else. And he chose to go ahead and get the iPhone. So it was his t a decision entirely. He could have gotten a phone a lot cheaper than the one he got, but he knew that his phone lasted his last phone lasted for four and a half years. So I think that's why he decided to go ahead and get the iPhone. So anyway, I am thankful that we were able to get new phones, even though I'm going to be paying on it for the next two years. Now John's phone was free and Neil, Neil paid for his phone, but I'm going to be paying on my phone for the next two years. So to get all new phones, it was not terrible. No. Well, not for us. If we would have paid for Neil's phone too, it would not have been pleasant. Well, we would have almost been, I don't know, I, I would have felt almost obligated to buy Nick a phone because it would have got one free. You know what I mean? Yeah, but then you got the monthly fees. I know. Anyway, the other thing we did today was we talked about maybe going on vacation with John's family in the summer, um, like end of July or early August. We talked about maybe going on vacation with them, so. We'll see. We'll talk. We're planning on talking about talking about it on Christmas when everybody's here. Uh, his one sister was not there because um, she was on like a weekend vacation or something like that today. So or yesterday and today. Um, I think or did they go to like a symphony or they went to New York City for something? I don't know what it was. Um, 
anyway whatever it was they were heading back today they did not come to my mother-in-law's house so we're supposed to talk about it on christmas on if we're gonna all go together and if we all go together then when we're gonna go we pretty much targeted three weeks um the last week in july the first week in august and the second week in august or like the weeks that we targeted um but then again we might not go because of things things yeah we hate things I don't know that we hate things. We just get very annoyed and frustrated by things. And I'm not talking about John's sister. <laughs> Both of his and sisters are fine. We're not talking about John either. We're not talking about John. We're not talking about John's sisters. And we're not talking about uh, John's parents. Uh, specifically, we're talking about the one sister who was not there. Her husband is difficult, to say the least. Um it's it's he's a challenge <laughs> anyway it is time for bed i hope today was better than yesterday and i hope tomorrow will be just a little bit better than today i hope y'all are having a great day and i will see you tomorrow bye